at first go to the sprite list and choose the sprite we are going to choose car first choose the purple car now place it at the edge of the screen now again go to the sprite list and choose another car as because it's a race now again this one car you put it at the edge of the screen now just little bit size uh, I want to change so this car should look similar size like that one now go to the backdrop change the backdrop with one road backdrop so this one is appearing now according to the road we need to adjust the car at the edge so this is how we are doing now again go to the sprite list and we are going to make one bar kind of thing which will be like a finishing point so choose this rectangle bar and place it like this and change the color of the bar i am changing it uh, into the red color so this kind of grid will not work we will choose the first one full grid we are choosing the color red now we need to write one text uh, you can write either stop or end i am just writing it as end as because the color of the text is also red that's why it is not visible now we are going to change the color from here the uh, black color will be the appropriate one now change the direction like this by dragging the cursor now let me just make a little bit larger in size means the text now place it inside the bar now the bar should be at the end of the edge means the opposite side of the of those cars so for that i'm just dragging it and putting it at the edge of this screen or stage now i want to just uh, little bit decrease the size of the rectangle bar so this is how you can do now i'm just making the size of the text also little bit smaller not too much it should be visible otherwise what's the point of writing this so that's it little bit more okay perfect now we are going to start writing a code after this let's go and choose the first one car and go to the code option and let's just start picking important blocks at first when flag clicked then let's go to the motion block set the place of x and y axis means the starting point of the first purple car which you can see now choose the forever block we want the car race when it will happen the car should move forever so move 10 step have to be kept inside forever block now from here we have to choose one condition so we need to use if then block now whenever we are we want to give the condition so what should be the condition over here we have to give the car condition such a way that it should sense the particular ending bar and it should stop running beyond that so for that we should go to sensing block so in sensing block there is a touching option is there which we can place inside if the next block now from here we have to give the name which we can remember so first one car i am giving purple color means purple as a name second as a green this right name and the last one i am giving as a stop bar now again move to the purple car script area there we are going to choose whenever the stop uh, sprite will be touched or sensed then the all the car should stop working 
actually it should be the purple car only that we will look afterwards now let's just write a script by dragging blocks starting with when start click for green sprite then the starting position we need to fix with this go to block now again the same thing choose the forever block and it should move steps so keep that one block inside forever now choose the if then condition again the same thing now again touching whenever it will touch the stop one sprite what it will do it will stop it will not move anywhere beyond it this one script only going to end now see when i am running the code both of the car is moving at the same speed then what is the point this is a car race so what we can do we can change the number of step we can increase or decrease so that one car will move faster than other so in green car i am increasing the value with 20 steps now if you will see another thing i am going to do let's just uh, show one message whenever it's going to touch the whoever is going to touch the bar fast they will say yeah i won now place it here properly it should placed above this now see now this word coming but it's coming for a short amount of time so you can make it for four second now let's see our project in a full screen mode I hope you understood the project. Thank you class.